Yo guys, really quick before the video starts, according to YouTube's analytics, 98% of you that watch my videos aren't subscribed, which is like, what are you doing, bro? Just hit the button. All right, guys, enjoy the video. Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are once again back on Animal Crossing New Horizons, and I wanted to share with you guys how to find the secret friendly ghost, Wisp. Uh, if you guys didn't know, there is a secret ghost who will visit your island every now and again in the wee hours of the morning and just float around and be there. Uh, he's very easy to find if he is there. Uh, however, he is a complete random, so he's not going to be on your island every single night. And generally, the way it works works is when you start a brand new island after a few days he will make a visit after that he will appear at random so generally a few times a month uh, if you are looking for him specifically if you're time traveling or you're just playing regular I would recommend every night of every day in a row make sure that you go out sometime after 8 p.m. Uh, I would recommend doing it really late like wait until about midnight uh, and scavenger island for him he is very easy to find like I said if he's there he's giant and he's glowing however you want to make sure that you check every nook and cranny no pun intended uh, because he can be on the elevated services the, the places that you wouldn't think to look for him so make sure that you do check your island in full so uh, so that you know he's not there if he is there if you didn't manage to find him when you find him he's going to get spooked and he, he's all his little souls are going to go flying in different directions and essentially what you need to do for him uh, is talk to him and get a net and go catch all five of his souls his parts and you guys will find them pretty easily as you guys will see in this gameplay they're just floating randomly around the map you need to collect five once you collect all five you're going to take them back to wisp and give them back to him he will then give you a reward you've got two options you can take something new or something expensive now the something expensive option may be a very tempting thing to click however i highly recommend you go with something new almost all of the time uh, the something expensive is actually not something expensive he makes a very clear statement that he generally gets mixed up when it comes to things that are expensive by not knowing the value and uh, almost every time I've run into him as well as a lot of other people that I've talked to have always gotten something that's not worth a lot so uh, it's definitely worth going after something new because every time you do click that option you are going to get some new item to your collection that you do not already have so the something new is definitely the best way to go about it uh, do not do the something expensive it's definitely not worth it and it might be something that you already have so something new if you find him uh, but yeah finding him again I would just recommend every night going out very late it's not like he just appears randomly for like an hour if he's going to be on your island on a specific day he's going to be out there as soon as it gets dark and he will stay until the sun comes up so don't worry about finding a specific time that he's going to be there if he's going to be there during the night on that specific day he will be there all night and you'll be able to find him but if you guys have any questions or anything else to add about finding Wisp the Ghost on your uh, Animal Crossing New Horizons Island, please make sure to leave a comment down below, and I'll be sure and try to help some of you guys out. But I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see all you guys in the next video. Can we be